Hello everyone. We talk about welding inspection and its technology in this YouTube channel and welding is very important from construction to fabrication industry. Inspection of the welds not only during welding but before, during and after the welding is very important. In this video, we will talk about seven points to check or to consider before starting the welding process. First and most important point is pre-welding inspection for the material condition. The base metal for the welding is one of the important part of the performance of the weld during its service. So base metal inspection is very important. Inspector needs to check for any mill slag, rust, dirt, oil or any other foreign particles on the surface of the base metal. This area can be around 3 to 4 inches. Inspector needs to make sure the area is properly clean and ready for the welding. Another point is base metal certification. It is very important to use the right welding process along with the right base metal. So before starts the welding, welding inspector needs to verify that material type, heat number, mechanical properties, chemical properties are comply with the requirement of the welding process. The second point is about dimensional accuracy. Base metal fit up is first step before even starting the welding process. Now during the fit up of the base metal, proper root opening, bevel angle, and level or the alignment of the base metal needs to verify by the inspector before even starting the welding process. It is also important to ensure or to verify the dimension of the base metal which is the thickness of the base metal according to the drawing specification or welding process. Third point is about welding procedure compliance. Welding procedure specification which is also known as WPS is crucial part of welding process. Some of the important parameters which are mentioned in WPS which must be followed during the welding process are current, voltage, preheat temperature and other important requirements. Welding inspector must study the WPS and try to inspect the same based on the requirements mentioned in the WPS. Generally, WPS is approved by design engineer or it is written by design engineer and verified by welding inspector. Safety precaution. Safety is important for everyone. Safety is non-negotiable. Welding area must be ventilated properly. and welder must have personal protective equipment wear during the welding process and it's welding inspector's responsibility to verify that and if there is any unsafe condition work must be stopped and everyone's safety must be considered fifth point is about equipment inspection The welding equipment itself must be inspected. It includes machines, electrodes and gas supply. Any malfunctioning machine can lead a faulty weld. So welding inspector must verify that equipment, electrodes and gas are in a proper working condition before allowing or before starting any welding process. One of the important point about welding machine is welding machine shall be calibrated based on the local or specifications requirement and welding inspector must verify the calibration is latest for the welding machine. Sixth point is about documentation. Proper documentation ensures traceability and the compliance of the welding. Welding procedures, welder's qualification, approved drawings, approved specifications, filler and well metal traceability, 
and inspection reports which are needed to perform the inspection must be available and prepared by the welding inspectors as a part of their welding inspection duty seventh and last point is about the knowledge welding inspector must be knowledgeable about the welding process and acceptance criteria for the job welding is one of the tough work and communicate and collaborate with the welder is very important to understand the actual scenario and actual challenges during the welding process welding inspector must have knowledge of weld and welding symbols understanding about the drawings welding positions and welding defects there are also many other points which welding inspector should know to perform a good welding inspection along with the documentation i have mentioned various welding inspection related topic in this youtube channel and planning to do the same for the future so if you guys have any specific questions or you want to learn anything specifically please mention in the comment section below thank you